Today, we will be watching the stop of a sovereign citizen, free traveler, who claims his stack of papers in the back seat is greater than the law in Florida. Hello, everybody. Welcome to Common Sense Academy. I'm your host, Joe Pometto, Joe the Lawyer. Um, if you like my content, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Free way to support the show. Most importantly, right now, I'm looking for subscribers. A majority of my viewers are actually not subscribed, and I have over 4,000 subscribers. Um, I'm trying to get to 10,000. YouTube will open up uh, new things that I can do on the channel, um, like a dual screen type stuff. Also, I'll get a merchandise shelf. So please, subscribe uh, to the show. Also, sign up for my email email list. You sign up for the email list, you get a free PDF on the history and examination of the sovereign citizen movement. You can unsubscribe anytime. Um, this video we're going to watch. Uh, we got a little window smashing, some free traveler uh, arguments. Uh, a couple of officers make a stop in Florida. The sovereign citizen spits off a whole smorgasbord of sovereign citizen nonsense at one point. But before we watch the video, everyone, uh, Raise your cup in the air, your glass, your carafe, whatever it is you like to drink out of. My preferred beverage, number one overall, is coffee. Um, I also like Diet Coke and water. That's what I sustain myself on. Raise your cup in the air. Cheers. Uh, prost. Um, salute. Drink with me. Cheers. Ah, tastes better when we sip together. Now let's watch this video. Are you going to get out of the car for me? No, I have done nothing wrong. I have broken no law. I wasn't speeding. I wasn't driving erratically. I was just traveling to work. That's all I was doing. So, you know, you're this is recording. That's okay. fine. All right, you're going to have to step out of the car for me. No, thank you. I haven't done anything wrong. Why do I need to step out of the vehicle? Because you don't have a, a tag on your car. You don't have a license. This is my personal convenience. I don't need a driver's license, registration, and all that. I, I, I don't have that luxury. Florida state law says you do. Show me. That's on you. Sh Show I'll, me. I'll, I'll be more than happy to print it out for you. I got a printer on my car and everything. I'll print it out for you. But that is on you. It is your responsibility. I want to see... And those laws I'm not doing. State, I have no. In the state of Florida, then you have to be. You have to abide by those laws. If you don't like that, then find somewhere else that uh, doesn't require to have a driver's license, which is not in the United States of America. That is the law. So you're gonna have to step out of the car for me. No, thank you. I'm, I, I'm not doing anything wrong. I'm. Your, I'm simply you're, traveling you're gonna out, to gonna, and from work. I'm gonna have to break the window and come in after you. <sighs> no, I don't want to call. That's destruction of private property. Okay. Just watch him for a second. I want to see your captain or whoever. I already called him. I started this on this list. Thank you. Put your hands on the steering wheel. I'll be right back. What's uh, what's this? What's your first name? Let's just go with Jake. Jake? Yeah. Alright, let's do this, Jake. I I'm telling you right now, I want to do this as smoothly and easily as possible for you, okay? So, I would, I'm asking you again to please step out of the car for me. What's your... Why did you pull me over? Other than I don't have a tag. Because you don't have a tag. That's illegal. Yes, it is. In, in the state Not of Florida. Not having a tag visible is already is a traffic infraction. Not having registration on the vehicle is... Public. You're trying to tell Not me... Not having a driver's license is also permanent. You're trying to tell me lies right now. I'm not telling you. Lies. I have a I'm whole pan. I have a whole book back there that says otherwise. You're trying to tell me... You printed off of, uh, for the Florida State statutes? <laughs> I printed it off... Somebody else put something on the internet. Uh, no, this is <clears throat> straight out of the legal dictionary, sir. Black's Law... I have. <laughs> are you are you going to get out of the car or not? No, no, thank you. I would rather not. You'd rather not. I would rather not. 
the reason I'm not doing anything wrong. I haven't done anything wrong. I haven't broken any law. Common law yeah. is a law of the I have the common law right to travel to and from anywhere I choose to go, yes? See, no, you do not. No, no, I don't. You do I don't have the constitutional right to do anything that I'm doing right now. Do I? If you have a driver's license. Do I have the constitutional right to do anything? I, w I, I would like to see counsel. Okay. My supervisor's on the way, okay? Okay. But you're going to have to get out of the car. No, me. thank you. You're, you're going to have to get out of the no, car. No, thank you. I understand, you. I understand the situation, but what I'm doing is nothing wrong. Nothing. I, I didn't break a speed limit. I didn't. I was traveling with traffic. I wasn't driving erratically. I wasn't doing anything. I'm simply traveling to and from work. That's all I'm doing. Which you have to have. Board no, you law. do not. You can tell me all your lies all you want, but no. I have a whole stack of papers back there that says otherwise. This is America. Yes, it is. Now, Florida. <laughs> Hmm. I don't. I would rather not speak to you. I want to see counsel. Okay. Which that that'll come in the very near future. Okay. Thank Cause you. Because you're, you're gonna you're gonna end up meeting. Him. Okay. But it is in your very best interest if you unlock the vehicle and step out on your own accord. Why? Otherwise, I'm gonna have to forcefully remove you from your vehicle. Why is that? Because I have I haven't broken any law. To because you don't what have is the law that I broke? You don't have a license and you don't have a registration on your vehicle. I do not follow. I do not fall under your jurisdiction. If you are in the state of Florida, you do. <laughs> Just because I'm in the state of Florida doesn't mean that I follow. Uh, that I fall under How the laws of Florida America? all my life. Do you like America? Do you are you proud to be an American? Sure. So you like to live in America, but you don't like to follow the laws of America. Laws versus codes and statutes. <laughs> I fall in, I, I follow common law. Do no harm to nobody. Don't steal from nobody. Unfortunately for you, there are laws that are in place that state you must have a driver's license to drive a vehicle. No. And your vehicle must be registered with the state. Okay? No. Yes. No. There's no maybe. There is, yes. Okay. Record all you want. This is recording too. I understand that. So you gotta out of the car? No, thank you. I haven't done. I haven't broken any law. I haven't done anything wrong. I'm just traveling to and from work. That's all I'm doing. I have the right to do that. I'm just doing what I have the right to do. I don't want to cause any drama. I'm just trying to support my family. You don't want to cause any drama? Correct. Well, that's what you're about to do. How is that? Because I'm going to have to forcefully remove you from your car. It would definitely be in your very best interest if you just got out. 
I'm trying to avoid anything further. Been very, very, very patient. You do not have. You cannot just break my. <sighs> because you want to. It's not what I want to do. It's what I'm going to have to do, though. Why? I haven't broken any law. Here it says there's no registration. So. Sir, you understand the state of Florida you're required to tell me who you are. I have. Let's go with the fifth. Okay. What, what's going on there? Why, why don't you want to identify who you are? I just am traveling to and from work. Okay. I have the right to do that. Okay. The license and registration and all that, I don't need it. Yeah, you I don't do. know. You make this a lot easier. One, a driver, a driver mm -hmm. is defined as one employed in operating a, tra a train, motorized, anything. Okay. I'm not. I'm traveling in my personal conveyance mm -hmm. to my job, and that's it. I'm not breaking any laws. I'm not. So you just, you just said that driving is somebody operating a motor vehicle, correct? This is an automobile. Motor vehicle, which is an automobile. No, it's not the same exactly thing. What you're doing. I have a pamphlet that says different. Okay. I am. This is my personal conveyance. Your personal. I am conveyance. traveling to work. That's it. Okay, so why don't you want to identify yourself? That's plain and simple. Do you not have a driver's license? I don't need a driver's license. Okay, can you just tell me your name? Jake. Let's go with Jake. Just Jacob. No, Jake. Just go with Jake. Just Jake. Sure. Your name could be Tom or something else. Do you have no way of telling me? I don't. Name? I haven't broken any law. So therefore, I don't. I don't have to provide. <laughs> <laughs> anything. I shouldn't even be even talking to you. You pulled over for a traffic violation. That's. I'm not part of. I'm not part of your corporation. I'm sorry. Okay. So you want to do it this way to where I, you're going to make yourself go to jail because uh, you're going to make this a lot easier. I haven't broken any law, so why why should you I go to traffic violation? You're refusing to identify. What who was a right traffic violation? Why? A traffic violation does not. What traffic violation? You don't have a tag on your vehicle. That is not a traffic violation. It, it is a traffic violation. No, it is not. It is not. No, it is not. Okay. I fall under common law jurisdiction. Okay. I am not about to play this. I'm not... Okay, well, nobody's trying to play anything with you, sir. We just have a job to do, okay? We're trying to get you out of here as fast as possible. That's well, all. Okay, then let, let me be on my way. Okay. We're I would like to be on my way. Yeah, I haven't broken any law. If you provide your identification, you'll be free to go. I do not need to provide. <sighs> I do not need to provide my information. I haven't broken any law. There's no injured party. There's nobody complaining against me. I haven't broken any law. Okay, well let me let me ask you something. Okay, if you is the vehicle registered to you? I own it. Okay, you own it. So go ahead and remove the thing, the thing you were covering your VIN number with. No, thank you. That's, you don't have to hand me anything. I, get I do not have to. I do not have to provide any information incriminating myself on anything. Okay, you're not incriminating yourself. You're identifying who you are. Exactly. That's incriminating. <laughs> Look, my lawyer told me mm -hmm. I shouldn't be talking to you. Okay. I haven't broken any law. I haven't done anything wrong. I, <laughs> I'm just traveling to and from work. That's okay. all I am doing. There's no need in violence. There's no need in breaking my personal conveyance in any way, shape, or form. Yeah, we, we don't I haven't broken any law. Your your guy said that he was going to smash my window and remove me from the car when I haven't done anything wrong. You and and if wrong. okay, if I was to pull you over mm -hmm. and yank and bust your window and yank you out of your car, what? Okay. Then what? Well, I would at least provide my information as I'm supposed to for Florida law. <laughs> Only if you've committed a crime and I haven't committed a crime. You've committed a traffic violation. That is not a crime. That is not a crime. That is not a crime. It is a crime. No. In the state of Florida, it is a crime. It is not a crime. 
We're trying to make this a lot easier for you. All you have to do is just, like I said, if you just move the cardboard from there, you don't have to provide me anything. We just need to verify who you are, and then you'll be on your way. That is exactly... That's all we need to do is just verify who you are, that's all. No, thank you. I would like to be on my way. I haven't broken any law. Okay, well, I have committed no law. crime. We're trying to avoid taking you to jail. I don't need to go to jail because I haven't done anything wrong. Right now, you're refusing an investigation by you recording me right now, which is evidence. So when you do go to jail, we're going to seize your phone. Get a warrant, That's get fine. A video on it. That's fine. And they'll, everybody will see that you're acting I, I'm unprofessionally. Not, I'm not acting any way at all. I'm just asking you just to get your information and then have you on your way. You're making this a lot bigger deal than it actually is. I understand you want to go home. The faster you give us your information... Oh, no, I don't want to go. I want to go to work. Okay. Well, you're not going to get to work either. That's all I would like to do. Is go to work. Okay. I would like for you to go to work too. But at the same time, you know, work with us. I understand you have your beliefs and everything else. It's not a belief. It, it's not a belief at all. No, nope, I got a pack of papers back there that says different. Okay, can I see that pack of papers? Sure you can, but I don't want to get shot. Okay. <laughs> Where, where's it at? Uh, right behind me. Right behind you. Do yep. you have any firearms in the car? Hell no. Okay. Where's in that little binder right there? Yeah. Okay. If you want to reach for it and show me it, that's fine. Okay. I don't have it all like organized or anything like that. That's straight out of a legal dictionary. I see that right all on the, inter uh, on the internet. Off, off Wikipedia, too. What I'm doing, I have the right to do, and I'm not... Okay, yeah, you have the right to print stuff off the internet. <laughs> no, I'm traveling. Okay. It's gone all the way up to the Supreme Court. I just haven't had that the time to print that one out yet. But this has gone all the way up into the Supreme Court. The right to travel is... <laughs> well, well, driving's a privilege, it's not a right. No. Yes, for them. For you. For them. For them, the rules, for the you. Rules don't apply to you. No, 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 no. I fall under common law. Okay. I'm not part... I don't take part in this corporation. Okay, that's what I mean. They, they don't apply to you. No, I didn't say that. I fall under common law. Common law is don't steal, don't shoot nobody, don't kill nobody, don't okay. don't do harm to others. I haven't the done. Laws of the state of Florida don't apply to you. This. <laughs> just if you follow common law. I would like to be free to go. Well, you're you're not free to go. I haven't done. I haven't broken any law. You're, you're breaking law. law right now. Law. Law, yes. Common law. law. I No, common law. Again, like I said, according to you, the Florida laws don't apply to you because you only follow common law. Common law. Yeah. Common law, don't... This stuff, you, you know, I'm, I'm going to be... I'm going to be quiet now because... I haven't done anything wrong. I haven't broken any well, law. I told you you've done something wrong according to no. Florida law, but you don't feel that you've broken any of your laws, so. They're not my laws. It's common law. I know. That's what I'm saying. They're your laws that you follow.
Dude, I don't think anybody's been rude to you at this point or anything like that. Just trying to do our job, sir. Thanks. Your job. What your... kind of work? What kind of work do you do? <sighs> right now, tree work. What kind? Tree work. Okay. I'm gonna I'm gonna stop talking now. All right, that's that's fine. Who do you work for? I would like to see my counsel now. Okay, you can call them and have them come here if they want. I don't have to provide you counsel. You provide your own counsel. So you said you have them, so go ahead and call them. Don't, I'm recording too, so nothing's going to happen to you. So if you're requesting to see your counsel, go ahead and call them. Don't go reaching for anything. You don't, you don't want to talk anymore. I don't have to. So at this point, there's absolutely nothing I can do to convince you in any way to go ahead and just cooperate with our investigation. I don't need to. I haven't broken. I, I've already. I haven't done anything. I haven't done anything wrong. I'm simply traveling to and from work. Okay. Again, I haven't yes. broken any law. I have hurt nobody. Where is the injured party? There's absolutely nothing I can do. Where is the injured? Where is the injured party? Okay, we've already, we, I've already explained all this to you. No, you haven't. You were stopped for a traffic violation. For Florida law, you must identify yourself. You're also giving us more reason to believe something's wrong because now you're covering your vid number. There's nothing wrong. I'm not trying to. I am doing nothing wrong. I have done nothing wrong. Okay. <laughs> Again, you have done something wrong. No, I have vehicle? not. No, no, I have not. Okay, then where's the tag of your vehicle? This is my personal conveyance. This is private property. I do not need a tag. I do not need to have it registered. I do not need to have a driver's license. A driver... 
So you're saying you don't have a driver's license? I don't need one. I don't have one. I never will. Okay. So you've never had a driver's license at all? I'm done talking to you. Thank you. Okay, well, you've already told me you don't have a driver's license. But again, there's nothing I can do at this point to get your cooperation to provide some kind of photo ID. I don't have, I don't have ID. You don't have an ID at all? The only thing I have is my debit card. Okay. Does it have your name on it? Yes, it does. Okay. Can you just hold it up against the window? That way I can see your name. I have to go in my bag for it, and your guy over here has been itchy. Okay. Do you have anything in your bag? <laughs> okay. Other than stuff I go to work with. Okay. And you said you do tree work, right? So you'd have no firearms or anything like that? No. Just maybe a pocket knife or something, right? Maybe. Okay. No, I don't, I don't, yeah. Where, where is your debit card in your bag? In my top pocket by the handle. Okay. If you do it slowly enough, you can put the bag in your lap and reach for your debit card, okay? Ten foot. Jacob Neal. That's all I'm going to say. Thank you. How old are you, Jacob? That's all I'm going to say. <gasps> Need to get the water that fell. What's that? I'm going to get the water that fell. Where's it at? Right there. Yeah, that's fine. Like I said, Jacob, all we want to do is get you to work, man. You know? Mm-hmm. Like I said, I, I know you believe in the whole sovereign citizen thing. I get that. That's what you want to go by. Nope. But at the end of the day, I'm just an American. Do do? I'm just an American. Okay. That's all. That's it. That's all I'm saying. I'm done. And I appreciate you cooperating with me on that. Have you ever had any type of ID through the state of Florida? What about any other states? I'm not saying any more. Thank you. Jacob. Just just so we're clear, just so it you know to letting you know the situation, okay? If you don't step out, I want to step out peacefully. I haven't broken any law, I don't need to. If you don't then we're going to have to... I have not... By any means necessary. I have not broken any law. You I haven't broken... Me, right? I haven't broken... <laughs> awesome. Where is it? But you understand what I'm telling you, right? You're telling me that you're going to break my property. My property. You're going to break my property and take me out of... Yes, you are. You're telling me that you, you're going to break my property and remove me from the vehicle... Because I'm doing something that I have the right to do. Like this officer already explained to you, driving is a privilege. It's not no. Right. Yes, for her. She has a license, I'm sure. Exactly, she and a plate on her sure. car. Mm -hmm. <laughs> it's a part of the corporation that I do not fall under. Thank you. You're breaking my civil rights, and every every moment it ticks by. You're just threatening to do it even more. I haven't done anything wrong. Okay. There is no injured party. Jacob, I've, I've already told you, by, by what you're doing right now, refusing to identify yourself. You, are you have my name. What's that? You have my name. No That's all you need. Coming back. Because I'm a private citizen. 
I do not need to tell I do not need to tell you anymore. I am a private citizen. I do not need to be a part of your corporation. Thank you. I haven't done anything wrong. There is no injured party. I don't I haven't hurt nobody. I wasn't driving erratically or, or anything. I was simply traveling to right, work. You. That's it. Jacob, are you gonna get out of the car? No, thank you. I do not I do not need to. I haven't broken any law. I haven't done anything wrong. I there I haven't hurt anybody. I haven't done anything wrong. I do not need any of this. I am just simply traveling to work. I'm a private. Right, so Jacob, I'm a private citizen. You do not need to do this. Ah! Thirty minutes of screen time with this sovereign citizen for about two seconds of a window smash. Boy, there's a lot to unpack here. I know this is a long video. Maybe jump off and jump back on to watch the rest of it. Um, okay, so. Uh, this individual was pulled over for not having a tag, and it appears that the officers uh, in Florida, um, you know, ran his uh, registration, saw that he had no license either. He says to, uh, he, so this guy starts with the sovereign citizen BS right away. I have a right to travel. I have a right to travel. Uh, the officer says, Florida law requires a driver's license. And the guy, oh, no, no, it does, blah, blah, blah. And the officer, I, I, I kind of got a kick out of this officer. He's dealt with sovereigns before, or he's good. He's just good on his toes. He goes, do you want me to print out the law? I can bring it over to you. <laughs> And the guy says, oh, no, 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 I'm simply traveling. I'm simply traveling. Um, uh, the officer says to him early on in the exchange, I'm going to have to break the window. Throughout this entire 30-minute exchange, this sovereign citizen is uh, warned multiple times. They're going to have to break the window. They're going to have to forcefully remove him. He says, oh, hey, go get a supervisor. He says, my supervisor is on my way. These officers really followed uh, procedure well and uh, exhausted everything that they could before they had to smash this dude's window in. Um, at one point, the guy says, I have a whole book that says otherwise. It's a legal dictionary. And then he says, I haven't broken any laws. I wasn't doing anything wrong. I have a whole stack of papers that say otherwise. And later, later on in the video, he he goes and he he gets the pay. He the officer grabs the papers out of the back door. The guy says, "I'm scared to turn to get the papers. I might get shot." So the officer grabs the papers from the back door and he's holding he's holding up these papers. Okay, and it, it, it looks like it looks like children's stationery. I mean, I guess you print on what you got. It's like this Christmas flare children's stationery and he's handing it to these officers as the law i uh, i this guy fits into one of my categories he's one of the down and outers all right i don't believe he's a true believer when it comes to the sovereign citizen though he's a, the, though the officer does say at one point you have your beliefs oh they're not beliefs it's the common law no dude they're just your beliefs okay um I don't think this guy is a true believer. I think he lost his license or he's driving without his license for whatever reason. He may have one, at one point said he never had a driver's license. Um, it used to be easier, uh, I imagine, to get away with driving without a license. Today with technology, the police can look up your vehicle so quickly, it's very difficult. Um, so I think he was a down and outer, went on the internet, found this sovereign citizen nonsense, printed it all out, put it in the back seat like a substitute for his driver's license. I got a stack of papers from a legal dictionary. It's a fake legal dictionary, dude. He didn't even cite Black's Law. I thought he was going to throw Black's Law out there, and he didn't. Um, at a certain point, he says, I'm going to seek counsel. Um, 
and the officer dealt with this perfectly. He says, counsel will come in in the future. You're going to be needing it, <laughs> he said. And he also tells the sovereign, look, you can call your counsel, have them come down here. That's true. A, and a lawyer can do that, but the lawyer's not going to be able to interfere with what the police are doing, nor is going to stop them from doing what they're going to do in that situation. The lawyer could try to talk them out of it, but otherwise would stand there as the police smashed the window. Um, he goes, you like to be an officer says to him, you like to be an American, but not follow the law. Oh, this isn't the law, blah, blah, blah. Like try, you know, that was a good psychology play on the part of the officer, tie him up with his American pride. Um, I thought that was a good move. Um, laws, he says at one point, laws versus codes and statutes. Listen, sir, I'm an attorney. I'm here to tell you that law, that the common law in the United States, we have a mixed system of common law and codes. The common law codes and statutes are all the law. The common law is not what you think it is. He appears to believe, he says an eye for an eye, he appears to believe that treat people how you want to be treated. The common law is just, there, there isn't actually any law, okay? It's just whatever you want it to be or you want to make it up, okay? Like, let's not have any laws. Let's just hope everybody treats everybody uh, like it says in the Bible. Listen, dude, that's dumb. And if you want to go to a country without laws, you're welcome to leave. He just spits off a smorgasbord of sovereign citizen nonsense. No injured party, right to travel, common law over statutes, blah, 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 all in his little stack of uh, fake legal papers, bro. All that crap in the world isn't going to prepare you when, you when you break the law. The officers know what the law is. They're trained on the law, and they don't care if you say otherwise. It really doesn't matter. Uh, go try your nonsense in the court of law. I don't, I, I, let me stop myself. I don't recommend that either. He says at one point, everyone will see you as acting unprofessional. I actually thought that these officers were extremely professional um, at every stage of the way. They kept their body cam on, recorded everything that happened. Um, he says at one point, it's not a belief, it's a pack of papers. I don't know what's worse, dude, whether it's just the belief in your mind or whether it's a pack of papers in the backseat printed on your, your kid's Christmas stationery. I mean, come on, bro. <laughs> Um, he really, yeah, he printed this in order to drive without a license. That that's all it comes down to. Um, and the, the whole time I'm like, what the heck is he puffing on and sucking on? He must've had a vape or something. I'm like, is he smoking marijuana in front of these guys? He probably would have been removed sooner if he wasn't, but you can hear him. You can hear this inhalation. At the end, it was a surprise break, um, a quick smash. The officer grabbed the window. I don't know if it was the same officer that did it. I think there might have been a third officer who came in and performed the actual break, and we hear the scream. Um, you know, this is a new one. I hope you guys enjoyed it. Uh, I hope we learned something here, too. Statutes, codes, common law, or all the law in the United States of America. One thing to know, though, is federal law will always always trump state law where the two conflict. That's an interesting uh, legal issue to talk about for me, perhaps, sometime. So thank you for tuning in to the Common Sense Academy. I'm Joe the Lawyer, Joe Palmetto. If you like my channel, please like, subscribe, comment, and share. Free way to support the show. Most importantly, subscribe. Most of my viewers are not subscribed, and I have over 4,000 subscribers. Um, please subscribe. I'm trying to get to 10,000 subscribers. It will open up new options for me on YouTube. I can do some neat dual screen stuff, and I also get a merchant merchandise shelf. Um, sign up for my email list. You get a free PDF on the history and examination of sovereign citizen movement written by yours truly. Also, I'm working on a full length ebook on the history and examination of the sovereign citizen movement. I'm going to drop some teasers once I get closer to being done, but um, it's really exciting having a lot of fun on it. Uh, a whole history of the sovereign citizen movement. Um, a lot of the ideas that it encompasses now, the different characters involved. I hope everybody enjoys it when it comes out. Um, thank you for tuning in. Common Sense Academy out.